She made a call when you turn me on Cause when you turn me you want me down I did not do the cart yesterday as I anticipated that I would, but we're gonna get it done today. I had a really busy day. Drawers all cleaned out. We had um, tea and coffee and everything in there before. Let us get started. Let's get rid of all of this stuff here. Oh. Oh my gosh, I hate plugging out this Keurig because when you plug this thing out, you have to reset the whole entire thing. So, I can't wait till, I don't know if they have one that doesn't do that anymore, but this is a pretty old one. That's what it does. Okay, so I bought this on Amazon. This is um, the Keurig pod tray. And so it's gonna hold them in a drawer format. Now, I was trying to get gold, but this isn't exactly the goals I wanted, but I'm gonna work with it because what's wrong with mixed metals, right? Okay, so let's go ahead and fill it up. So I'll just go ahead and store the rest in the pantry. This is something that I picked up at Home Goods, and it's actually a jewelry tray, but I thought it would be so great to hold tea bags and stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that. And this is just um, the Tezo Wild Sweet Orange Tea. Sometimes I like a little bit of flavor in my life. We're gonna go ahead and use the Bigelow's Premium Green Tea. I have some peppermint tea, but we only have those in bags. So we're gonna keep that in the drawer. I really do have to amp up my assortment of teas for the holiday season because when you have family come over, you definitely want to entertain and give everybody their teas of choice. As you guys can see, I don't have much empty space on the backsplash over here. So, I want to go ahead and hang this sign. It says Coffee and Jesus, which I thought was so cute. I just wanna let you guys know one thing. I was very inspired to do this coffee bar by my good friend Carla. And Carla also has a YouTube channel. Her YouTube channel is simply Carla Jones. She was so helpful because I was like so busy at the time trying to figure it out. And she was really helpful in helping me to source like all of the items that you see here today. So yeah, a lot of it came from Amazon and Carla, I thank you. Her videos are filled with goodness. So if you're a person that's into home decor, I would highly, highly recommend her videos to you and she knows her stuff. Um, I had a certain look that I was going for and she was like, boom, boom, boom. She had them all. And she also has an Amazon store. If you guys are interested in taking a look at her channel, she has an awesome channel. I'm gonna make sure that I link it down below. It's filled with shop with me videos and honestly, like, I use this as my tool. I have my list ready to go when I walk into the store. I know what I want because of Carla. Thank you, Carla. I'm gonna be sticking this Oh, backwards. I'm gonna be putting it this way on here, so let's get that going. Okay, it's up. The only thing I'm disappointed in, I don't know if you guys can see it really good, but it is a little visible, the command hooks that I use. So I'm not gonna dwell on it, but I wish I got something a little more invisible. Maybe I might actually put like command parts right on the sign next time. Okay, so this tray is something that I already had. That Coffee and Jesus was an Amazon pick. And so the tray, I don't remember where I got the tray. I probably got it from Home Goods. That's gonna be my big lucky guess. Now, even though I kind of don't like all the cords and everything, I don't think I can quite get rid of Amazon Alexa because there goes Alexa over there. Alexa is so useful 
for me, especially with homeschooling the kids. I got this pumpkin. I think this is an at-home purchase. So I got it for $19.99, and it was definitely an at-home store purchase. And I'm gonna go ahead and heighten that pumpkin right there and move her over just a little teeny tiny bit. Yeah, I think I'll leave her right like that. And these glasses, I thought they were so nice and I got these from Amazon. Okay, so I got that mini cupcake stand that you see right there. I got that from Amazon. I thought it was so cute and I liked the color and the look of it. I got these apothecary jars from Amazon. Oh, this is the wrong size. <laughs> Here we go. That is the way how it's supposed to go. So those apothecary jars, I got them from Amazon. I actually like them, they're pretty nice. It comes in a set of three and they were pretty affordable. These apothecary jars were $39.99 and it did come in a set of three. I'm gonna use the third one for something else. We're gonna stock the jars with the mini biscottis from Trader Joe's. I am also going to be using the chocolate chip cookie dunkers as well as the oatmeal cranberry dunker cookies. If you guys did not check out my Trader Joe's haul, you guys will see these items in that haul. find that when you're filling up the jars on the side it works out so much better it makes the items look so much neater inside the jar you definitely want your items to look nice right This is a tray, a ceramic tray that I've had for a really, really, really long time and I don't remember where I got it from or how I got it. This pumpkin looks like one that probably came from Home Goods. Don't ask me the price, but it obviously was a good price if it came from Home Goods. It's really nice and I got it because of course it is white and gold and I love those two colors. And this little vase, this kind of um, little mini jug or rustic looking vase, I put down with the pumpkins and a little bit of wheatgrass. <laughs> Here go a few additional little pumpkins to top it off. And that little one in the corner there is going to say thankful. So another thankful pumpkin. Okay, so I got this one from Home Goods and it is so good. It smells delicious. I'm sure you guys already know when you're organizing or when you're redecorating you have a plan in your head sometimes it doesn't always go as planned so here I am shifting things around 
And so I'm just trying to get a sense of what I'm doing here. This is the look so far. This is what we're working with. So I went kind of um, in a different direction and tried the Jordan's Skinny Syrup. I don't know if any of you guys have tried those before. I got them from Home Goods. They're really affordable. I think they were like $3.99 a bottle. They have a ton of different flavors. We got the Irish Cream Caramel Pecan, the Glazed Donut Vanilla, and yeah, I did say the Irish Cream to start. And um, I don't think they're bad. They're zero calories, so they probably don't taste as good as the Tarani Coffee, Coffee House flavors but they still it still works for what we want it to work for so i'm glad that we got a chance to actually try them let us know in the comment section if you guys have ever tried the jordan skinny syrups before and tell us what you think about them I came across some organic Lipton tea bags and I decided to go ahead and pop them in. So taking a look at this look, uh, I like a lot of the things that are on there that are clustered together, but I think it's a little bit too crowded. So I think I'm going to try to change this space up just a little bit. So I'm about to give it a different look. here I went ahead and added some honey sticks along with the spoons for some tea and for the second look I just went ahead and removed the tray to see how that would go what do you guys think about the second look Take a look at this oversized island. I'm gonna go ahead and decorate that one soon. If you guys are looking for more home decor videos, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell for more. Thank you guys for watching, bye.